the truth behind Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck's spats, couple butt heads because he struggles with being photographed and wants more privacy, but she insists he is happy as they pack on the PDA at Golden Globes. Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez's seemingly tense exchanges are a result of the pair butting heads over being photographed in public, with insiders claiming the Batman actor would prefer more privacy, but knows his wife loves being snapped. Affleck, 51, who has long had a fraught relationship with paparazzi, is often snapped looking downcast while gesticulating wildly at the singer, 54. Lopez insisted that her husband is happy when questioned about their apparent heated exchanges at the Golden Globes on Sunday night, where she was also awkwardly asked how she knows this is her last marriage. But a source appeared to clear up the misconception for good, and told DailyMail.com exclusively, Ben and Jen are doing very well. A lot of the times we see Ben upset, it's because he just hates the paps always following him and Jen. It is just one part of his day that he dreads, and oftentimes it seeps into his everyday life and it ends up looking like he is upset with the people he is with or his surroundings, when it is actually just some photographers that are just jerks. The insider continued, Ben doesn't like red carpet photos or being snapped by photographers when they are out doing regular life. He knows Jen loves it, so it does put them at odds at times but they eventually fall back to a place with each other to be happy. Navigating the life they live as a celebrity couple can be trying sometimes because Ben just wants to go to a restaurant or get coffee and be done with it and just have more privacy, but Jen is all about it. So, they butt heads there but it isn't in any way ruining their relationship. They are really in a good place. Affleck appeared to oblige at Sunday's event where they posed for a kiss inside the Beverly Hilton after Lopez had walked the red carpet alone. When asked about the actor's somewhat forlorn pictures, she told Entertainment Tonight, Ben is doing all right. You don't need to worry about Ben, let me just tell you. He is good. He is happy. I'm chilling, I don't understand what people are so pressed for. The pair recently sparked concern when they were pictured looking strained while shopping in the high-end boutiques of St. Bart's capital, Gustavia on December 30th. The Pearl Harbor actor looked exasperated as he helped his wife try on Bulgaria pieces, throwing his hands in the air as she sat next to him. However, they later appeared to kiss and make up, with Lopez cuddling her husband for a series of selfies. Another instance took place in May 2023 when the pair posed together at the premiere for Lopez's movie, The Mother. The Get Loud singer appeared to have a frown on her face and was gesticulating at her husband. An expert lip reader told Female, the couple were discussing how and where they should pose for photographers. Lopez appeared to ask Affleck whether her low-cut top was showing too much, prompting him to respond that it was fine. Three months prior, they appeared terse with each other at the Grammys. Fans believed Lopez was caught telling Affleck to act like he was enjoying himself and a lip reader commissioned by DailyMail.com confirmed it. Stop, Lopez told him. Look more friendly. Look motivated. Affleck replied, I might. Affleck and the singer have been married for just over a year after sensationally reconciling nearly two decades after their initial split. The couple, who first called off their engagement in 2004, reunited during the pandemic and said I do at the Little White Wedding Chapel in Las Vegas last summer. A more lavish ceremony at Affleck's Georgia Estate followed a month later. The hitmaker shares her twins M and Max with her ex-husband Mark Anthony. Prior to her rekindling with the actor, she was engaged to baseball pro Alex Rodriguez. The Gone Girl star was previously married to Jennifer Garner from 2005 to 2018. They share daughters Violet, Serafina, 13, and son Samuel, 10. Elsewhere, the insider also shared an update about how the pair have been managing their blended family, explaining that Affleck and Garner are co-parenting smoothly. The source noted, Ben and Jen, Garner, have figured out co-parenting. Everyone is friends and everyone has gotten to the point where making things work is the best scenario possible. No one wants any unneeded drama so they never chase it. All emotions are in the right place. In a recent interview with Variety, 
Jennifer confessed they both have PTSD from the glare of the spotlight on their first romance, but explained that in their present life as a married couple we're older now. We're wiser. She added, we also know what's important, what's really important in life, and it's not so much what other people think. It's about being true to who you are.